G-O-A-T. What are you talking about? Stop, stop playing with me. Okay, welcome to another interview podcast. My name is Dylan. Today we are talking about LeBron calling himself the GOAT to his son. Check it out. Trash. We made trash. You trash. <laughs> That's a lucky shot. Man, lucky shot. That's a lucky shot. shot. Give me the ball. Trash. Give me the ball. Huh? I'll shoot it one hand. How's it trash? You I'm suck, bro. All you suck. I suck. Mwah. <laughs> 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 you bro. All right, man. Watch this. Hey, this one my left hand, too. I'm not. No. Get, get it out the net. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Green. Oh my god. Bro, it's I seen you shit up. I actually have going a year, literally. <laughs> it's not going in, I don't know. Why are you tripping? Why are you acting like that? Like you doing? <laughs> this is what I do. Bro. This is when I go. This is one left time, hey, bro. I'm goat, bro. G O A T. What are you talking about? Stop playing with me, man. This is what I do, man. Alright, give me more. <laughs> you need a ball for what? Oh, uh, when it go in the net. <laughs> Piss it again, so it go point five. Man, I'm I'm right on you. No, Just worry about making the shot. Yeah, shot? yeah. yeah worry about making the shot. You talking point, yeah. point five? What? Right, nah. <laughs> that was too much rim, champ. Nah, my fault, my fault. Yeah, you count that. That's too much rim. All right. Count that one. Oh, oh my God. Huh? Hold on. <laughs> no, bro. I'm just saying, bro. Hood dribble. Hood dribble. Man, yo, jumper is cheeks. Bro, you still flat the ball. <laughs> why you blaming it? Why you uh? -uh. There we go. I mean, that was decent. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mid range. Oh, so you're a mid range assassin now. All right. Yeah, yeah, all right, yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> your, your rhythm going now? Nah, but it's cool though. I just get it right back. You know, your rhythm going out? Yeah, you just you just shoot it. All right, well, just shoot it then. I mean, just shoot it then. If that's what you're talking. You just shoot it. <laughs> so much. This is just a casual thing that LeBron is doing. Obviously, he's playing a game with his son here. His son calls him trash. And then he proceeds to call himself the GOAT. The greatest of all time. Better than Michael Jordan. Better than anybody else. No matter what way you want to see it. No matter if you think that he was serious or if he was playing around. I think we know that in LeBron's mind, he thinks that he's the GOAT. He's the greatest. But it's a real lack of humility not to single him out, all right? But it's a real lack of humility when you call yourself the GOAT when you should instead be having other people call you the GOAT. I mean, in Michael Jordan's career, you had Larry Bird call him Black Jesus. Magic Johnson called him the GOAT. A ton of NBA players, former NBA players called Michael Jordan the greatest, all right? If you really are the greatest, you have other people call you the greatest rather than calling yourself the greatest. I think that's the major difference here between Michael Jordan and between LeBron James. Because if even if you remember when um when when LeBron broke the scoring record and Shaq had asked him that question, I think about who he would take in NBA history, and he says himself. I personally think that. A lot of this, what he's doing here is that he's trying to convince all of us that he is the greatest. I think he wants to cement himself as the greatest. And I think he thinks that if he says it enough times, people will buy it. And um, I think with this generation, he might have a point. Because I remember speaking to one of my coworkers, it's a female, we're talking about LeBron. And she thought that he was the greatest. The thing is, she doesn't know anything about Michael Jordan or about Kobe. 
All she knows is about what she sees now. What everybody's talking about now. All right, she never saw Jordan hit a last second shot before. She never saw the wonder, you know, of Jordan scoring 40 something points, averaging 40 something points in NBA Finals before. All she knows is, oh, LeBron just broke the record. Oh, LeBron just, you know, won the championship um, in the bubble. That's all that they know, all right? Because this is somebody who is like 20 something years old. But real NBA fans, real NBA heads who know the game, have been watching the game for 20, 30 years, they really know what's going on. And it doesn't matter if somebody says that they're the GOAT, right? When you have tons of other former NBA players talking about who the real GOAT is and who the real most skillful player is, who the real um, best player in NBA history is. All right, we know. So it don't matter how much somebody else says it. I just want to show you guys this little video and that little lesson. So until next time.